Hey guys, welcome to another session of Epic 7. This is going to be a very, very quick one. Um, I'm going to do my start dash summon. So, this is kind of like a review to this pack. Honestly, I don't I don't really like reviewing packs since it's, it's literally like separating people who want to be strictly free to play. But honestly, when I saw the, the pricing of this, I actually had uh, no like question that I should get it. I mean, it's literally ten dollars i would assume that it would be like 30 or 50 dollars but it's ten dollars um and i was telling the stream as a joke that just skip a meal or two and you literally can get something pretty good out of this so regardless you will get one five star hero you'll get one five star artifact guaranteed on the ninth and tenth summon but in between you will one to eight you can actually get three to five star hero or artifact so people who could get really lucky i mean ten dollars is really not that much um, when you're talking about summons and all the packs that deal with summons, $10 for this uh, is very, very good pricing. If they keep coming out with packs like this, I, I swear they're gonna make a ton of money. But anyways, let's let's go. Uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go through this. <laughs> yeah, skip a meal for pixels. Yes. I think I think. If you really like the game, and I think this deal is probably way better for a newer player um, because you'll most likely be missing a ton of artifacts or even heroes. So skipping a meal, I mean, you can lose some weight at the same time. And uh, all right, so we got no no shinies. Okay, here we go. Here's our first, I think it's gonna be an artifact first and then a hero. Um, yeah, you can lose some weight, right? So, I mean, it's there's no, no, no problem with it. Yeah, artifact first. Let's see what we got. Yeah, it's unskippable. It's unskippable. Oh, I got a Lexus basket. Sweet. This is fantastic. I actually wanted another one. Okay, so that's not bad. I mean, but at this point, I have like pretty much all the five star artifacts, so I don't. Uh, this is good. All right, let's see what we get. I, I almost I almost debated myself and thinking that is lucky. I got a Destina. Um I'll keep it. Potentially Ruel imprint. If I <laughs> Yeah, perfect Ruel coming up. Yeah, it's not bad. I mean I'm missing Ludwig Haste. Uh what else am I missing? Fire Cecilia. Those are my RGB that I'm missing. So, but I'm not, I'm not, I'm not terrible, it's not terrible, because her self-imprint is actually good, and then Ruel is good too, so, if I can get Ruel, which is coming next week, we'll have to see. But regardless, that is it, um, so you guys saw what I got, uh, especially for the video recording, of course the guys on stream get it too, uh, oh, I got another growth pack, right, just, the <laughs> so much, so much, like, Buy this, it's so shiny. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna, yeah, that's my thoughts on it. I think I think it's a really good value, to be honest. Um, I wasn't expecting that, but it's way better than, for example, just really quick. It's way better than getting something like um, the monthly summon pack. <clears throat> so I don't get this um, because, I mean, look, you're getting 3,000 sky stones out of it. Yes, it technically could be good, but if you're talking about like specifically summons itself, that value is incredible. So, and you al you always get the guaranteed. So I, I think that's uh, that's pretty cool. Hope they bring that back uh, more often, um, but not too frequent. <laughs> like oh, once a month or maybe once a couple of months, I think that'd be pretty cool. Cause I think the, the more they space it out, the more people will, will want it again. Um, and uh, the potential is that later on they might increase the hero pool so uh, yeah another thing for that start dash i don't think it's actually there anymore because i'm yeah the start dash it could only pull like the heroes within like a certain amount of the the story but depending how far this game progresses of course potentially there could be new heroes in the pool so you know this also gives some players some opportunity not to having to pull on every single rgb banner that comes down the line so i think it's kind of cool overall Anyways, I'm going to end this for the video recording. If you guys have Discord, check out the Discord server. Follow me on Twitter. Subscribe to YouTube if you haven't. As always, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.